Ever wonder what America would look like without immigrants? Well, Thursday, February 16th marks a nationwide A Day Without Immigrants. The protest, which was set to originate in Washington, D.C., home to President Donald Trump's immigration ban, which is right now on hold, has spread across the country. The day of protest sprung from last week's arrest of around 680 illegal immigrants by Immigration and Customs Enforcement agents. The Department of Homeland Security, responsible for overseeing Immigration and Customs Enforcement, reported that 75% of those arrested were criminal aliens, which include anyone living in the U.S. illegally, and did include some convicted of sexual assault with a minor, murder, and drug trafficking. Now, regardless of legal status, the boycott asks foreign-born people nationwide not to go to work, school, or go shopping in demonstration of the importance of immigrants who support the U.S. economy. Many businesses and famous restaurants have closed in Washington, including those belonging to famous Spanish-born chef Jose Andres. In 2015, Andres also opted not to open a restaurant in Trump's new hotel because of comments that had been made about Mexican immigrants. Janet Merguia, president of the National Council of La Raza, a Latino activist group, tweeted, from doctors to dishwashers, immigrants are integral to daily life in the U.S. We stand with Chef Jose Andres, hashtag a day without immigrants. But knowing how divisive our country is right now, there are obviously mixed feelings about the protests. Some positive, here's one from Wednesday Will. I hope this is a huge impact and people realize just how important immigrants are to American society. And others are using this as an opportunity to bring awareness and find the illegals. At 10 GOP, to report illegal aliens, please call ICE. Kindly retweet and spread this information, thanks. ABC's The View also showed support posting their view of their studio without immigrants. Yup, nothing there. And as a proud legal immigrant myself from Canada, what would happen here? Hello? But seriously, this nation was formed with the help of immigrants, and we support the American dream for everyone, and we believe that is possible. So what do you think about a day without immigrants? Does it help? Does it matter? Did you participate? Let us know in the comments below. Like and subscribe for more of What's Trending.